Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Clash. Uh, today we're doing a 100th subscriber special video, and with me I have Matt from Boom Beach Bros. Oh, what's going on guys? Matt here from Boom Beach Bros. Um, and today we're doing the 100th um, subscriber special, as Clash um, said. So we're going to be doing something a little bit different today. We're going to actually use all tanks, but we're not allowed to um, reload our tanks at all. And we're going to take down Dr. Ted. Right. Uh, we will leave a link in the description to each other's channel, so you guys make sure to go check him out. Uh, yeah, same here for um, class. All right, so let's get down with it. Uh, he has double the tanks that I do, so yeah. he's most likely going to be beating me at this, but it's only for fun. So are, are your tanks already done? Um, I'm, gonna use some, I'm actually going to use some diamonds, but um, are yours done? Uh, yeah, but we can check out the um, operation first if you want. So let's go ahead and watch um, your attack. Alright, so here's me right here uh, taking down a level 50 operation here and uh, just start spamming out the warriors here and going straight through the middle with some smoke. It didn't work out too good when uh, I forgot to throw the other flare because they all just scattered and then the snipers got a lot of them. Yeah, I had to take that out next because a lot of them were going for the uh, little power cells. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I didn't know if anything else was going to hit me or not. Yeah, that's good. That was, that was a really good attack. Oh, thank you, man. And I forgot to mention to you guys, uh, my screen recorder might lag a little bit. Um, I've already told you guys why. There's a video down below uh, if you guys want to know why it's lagging. So, anyways, let's go ahead and continue off the video here. Do you want to show the other attack on the operation? Uh, Commander Jamar? Yeah, Commander Jamar. Yeah, sure. All right. Just so we can get rid of some diamonds of yours. I mean... I would usually go with just all DPS and just try to take out the base. I have to agree with you there. Yeah. Um, I watched a couple other um, YouTube, fellow YouTubers, and they were talking about how you should never go with um, medics. I mean, even though the medics do help them out uh, against this um, rocket launcher, but that rocket launcher is not going to beat out the pure power of the tanks. The tanks have a lot of health, and when the cannons shoot, these high-level cannons, that's one or two shots. Right. So when he's going against it, or if he's going against a boom cannon, it's one shot. You can't really uh, stop it. I mean, if there's a if maybe if there was like a um, bunch of sniper towers, it would make a difference. But here there isn't. So. Yeah, and I remember in one of the other updates, uh, they actually made the tanks more powerful. But then again, they um, uh, made them have less health, which I don't really yeah. see a big difference there. I think they gave them. They gave them less health, but the boom cannons and cannons don't do uh, double damage anymore. Right. Hey, how long have you been playing? Have you been playing since, uh, or all, also all of our subscribers, um, have you guys been playing um, since the boom mines used to be called tank mines? Uh, no, I actually haven't. Yeah, that was, I think that was during beta, um, or right around when it was during beta, and it Actually, I think maybe it was still when it first came out. But it was weird because now I'm thinking about it. That was a long... I think this is going to be two years 
since the game came out, because it came out, I think, around summer of 2013. Really? I've only had it for about a year now. Yeah, I've had it, I think I played it for a little bit, um, but it wasn't that fun. The graphics were really poor. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, and so I'm going to go ahead and use those diamonds, and let's go ahead and start off taking down Tear. Okay. You ready? I'm ready. All right. So we're going to start out here with the level 20 base of yeah, Dr. Terror. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and drop all my tanks on the back side and throw a barrage. And then I'm going to throw two, um, one artillery to make sure it goes down. Before I done that, I went ahead and just took out the uh, boom cannon and the shock launcher as well just to make sure that nothing interferes. Yeah, that, that's what I'm doing too. I'm just throwing all, everything I got on... Um, the only buildings that could actually hurt me. Right. And if you guys want to see uh, Matt's version or Boom Beach Bros yeah, version of this, for, um, please watch yeah. his video because uh, you'll be seeing what he's talking about. And it's, if you're watching mine, you're seeing what I'm talking about. Remember, check out him in the link below. I mean, in the description yeah. below. Sorry. Yeah, same thing for uh, Clash. He's going to be in the description below. I'm going to have a link to his video. So he's, just go ahead and click on that and it'll send you right there. All righty then. So, um, how are you doing with this? Um, I'm at, okay, so right here, I have all the defense ta uh, defenses out. I'm just letting my tanks roll, and ra uh, roll um, taking out all the defenses. I'm going to go ahead and start throwing some artilleries on the crates uh, just to help out take this base down. How about you? Um, I'm actually right over here by the headquarters. Uh, I took out the um, sniper tower, the boom cannon, and the shock launcher, and now I'm just over here blowing down the headquarters yes yeah, nothing is touching me right now so i'm good actually i have nothing left on the base except for the headquarters i think really yeah so and you mowed throw artillery for the win so you mowed through it <laughs> yeah there it goes um i got two dark fragments uh that's not that much um i think on levels one th one through three you can get a uh crystal really and all right, wait, have you, has your attack uh, finished up yet? Not quite yet. Uh, I got about 10% of the headquarters health left. Yeah, and also I want to tell you guys, we're not allowed to refill our troops at all. So um, we're basically using one uh, one set, and we're trying to go far as we can. Without, uh, I mean, if you do lose troops on, I mean, if we do lose troops on here, then we have to continue on with what we had. Yeah, so we only have one tank, we still got to go with the one tank. All right, so my attack is done now. All right, let's go ahead and get the uh, attack stage. I'm going to go ahead and scout him out. Uh, this should be pretty easy. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and drop everybody on the far corner and start taking out the defenses. I'm going to uh, send a barrage over here right in the middle after I've uh, put my artillery out there. So I've already pretty much taken out the sniper tower. One more hit left in it, and sniper tower is down. Now I'm going for that boom cannon. Yeah, I got the cannon and boom cannon already out of the way. All right, so, yeah, I've got the uh, sniper tower and the boom cannon out of the way. Oh, yeah, my sniper, the sniper tower is almost down. And I just oh, sent my all of my tanks to the right. So slow. Look at them. Yeah, I know, right? I just, like, yeah. Is, you know how they can like how they swivel the head and then they end up walking backwards with their um with their like. I don't know what it is on the back of them. I guess that's their uh, gas. Maybe. Uh, their gas for it. And it looks like sometimes they actually go forward with that side. I'm like, don't go that way. You're going to get hit. <laughs> Things yeah. Like <laughs> I've had that before. Yeah. I, I think uh, with the Scorchers, they do the same thing, but they end up, do, they actually do explode when they die. Except Scorchers are more powerful, of course. Yeah. Wait, you have to redo Scorchers when they're done. I mean, after that, right? What do you mean? I mean, uh... So they so if you win with scorchers, you don't get to keep them. Is that what you're trying to say? Keep them. Oh, okay. I thought you said they explode it. It's when they die, they blow up and they take out some defenses. Oh, that that would really really help. Yeah. So here, right here, I got a victory. Ah, I'm still going. I have this one mortar just shooting at me. It's not doing much damage to me, but I will make it. Yeah. I have. I got one intel, um, a dark shard, and just the normal loot. So. I'm going to go ahead and wait for you. All right, I am almost done here. I'm, I have less than half of the health of the headquarters left. All right. Looking at, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and scout out uh, Terror Stage 3. Right. 
So, I'm just going to tell you about it, too, as well. Okay. Okay. I think only thing you need to worry about for Terror Stage 3 is taking out these uh, shock launchers. Yeah, shock launchers? And, yeah, there's there's two shock launchers. What, a, what side? Two boom cannons. What side are they on? They're all, the whole thing is, like, smashed into the left side. Okay. Is that where the headquarters is as well? Yeah. All right, then. All right, so I'm going to tell you guys what I got here. I got 107,000 coins, 64,000 wood, 43,000 stone, 21,000 iron, and um, I got a dark fragment and a dark shard. Nice. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and look at this base. Yeah, I'm trying to see how much it would take. Yeah, you're, you're right about these shock launchers. They're, they don't look good. Yeah. Nor does that um, boom cannon. Not that bad to take out. Um, it's also the second one. I mean, I don't think I'll reach into the range of the second one. Yeah, but the idea that it's there is just pretty bad. Alright, so are you already attacking it? No, I'm just attacking it right now. Okay, so, I'll go ahead and do the exact same. Okay, so I'm gonna throw a barrage on the boom cannon. I just went ahead and, oh man, I, I have to retreat this one time. I mean, I didn't send out any troops or anything. Yeah, sorry. Because uh, one of my artillery hit a wrong spot. I didn't even mean to shoot that one. My thumb slipped. There we go. That that was good. Now I'm going to go ahead and send a barrage over here towards the shock launchers. And it doesn't look like it's doing much at all, which is bad. So I think they have these stat. Yep, they have the statues out here, which are making them a whole lot more powerful than what they already are. But statues on Terra are just crazy, especially um, uh, when you go against Colonel Gearheart. Oh, I hate her. She's got those level 90 bases. I can't, there's no way for me to even take her out. There's no way for me to even take out one thing on her base. I mean, I took out one, but then uh, they have those laser beams and doom cannons. It's horrible. Yeah, do you have any, um, do you have any prototype defenses? Yeah, I have uh, the shock blaster. Yeah, that's why I have two. I think you had, an, I saw one of your other videos, uh, you had enough for a... Was it a Doom Cannon? Um, no. Actually, I don't know. I think it's the Laser Beam. Laser Beam. I think that's what I'm going to do next. Alright, so, it looks like my troops are starting to near the Shock Launcher over here. Yeah, I got both Shock Launchers already out of the way. Ah, crap. I'm going to have to send the Health Kit over here. Uh, I mean, they weren't extremely hurt, but I'm going to have to send the Health Kit over here. Just to make sure that they don't get heavily damaged out here. Sure that they don't get in the range of the boom cannon. Right. So I might have to shock the shock launcher. <laughs> don't worry, you're going to create a black hole. <laughs> oh, that would be... Uh, that would actually be pretty fun. We'd end it all. Yeah, just everything. You, know, you win the game. Ooh, I'm about to lose a tank over here because of the cannon and the boom cannon. Uh, I lost one tank. Yeah, I'm going to have to bad. shock the uh, cannon over here and the boom cannon as well, but I did not shock the boom cannon. Wow. I just threw a barrage over there to the uh, boom cannon, but I'm all out of flares, so I'm going to lose this one. I definitely am going to lose this one. I have three tanks remaining, and headquarters is a little less than halfway down. Okay. If you think you're going to, if you're not gonna, if you don't beat this one, then I'm going to go ahead and finish off with it, uh, my last. All right, I, 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 no, I actually had three tanks, but I didn't see the other one, but uh, I went ahead and just retreated out of there. Because, uh, I mean, that's more coins to spend. Yeah, so, I'm gonna go, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and take on Terra Stage 4. Um, so, I'm just gonna tell you about it. It's actually not that bad. I think it's easier. It is? Yeah. Alright. pretty sad. So, do you want to switch this up at all? Um, I think this is a pretty good long video, so I think maybe... Well, uh, we'll have another one of these. If you guys, um, if you guys like the series idea, um, go ahead and smash that like button because if you do, we'll see that you guys like this and we'll do a lot more content like this. Definitely. Yeah, that was a really bad shock on my part. I only hit one defense. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and flare all the way up to the next to the rocket launcher. Should I think I'm gonna lose tank? Did I? No, I haven't lost the tank yet. Yeah. To keep you guys entertained while I'm not doing anything, while my troops are rearming, I'm going to go ahead and replay some of the attacks here 
on the uh, operation just so you guys can be a little bit entertained and watch at the exact same time and listen to what Matt and me have to say. Yeah, so um, what do you think is going to be in the next update? I was just going to ask you that because my, the base is just getting hit by well, the Well, what, what I was hoping here, um, I thought this was a pretty good idea myself, but of what I've been hearing, uh, ha well, first of all, have you ever played Clash of Clans? Yes. Well, uh, you know how they have these things called clan castles, which allow you to get troops and stuff? Yeah, they actually outruled that. Really? Yeah, if you look on the Boom Beach forums, um, you can see that they have um, the things that they have outruled and that they, they said that they're not going to have guaranteed. So they're not going to be making uh, donated troops? I mean, I don't know if they, I mean, they probably could implicate it if they wanted to. I'm going to get a spray here of water. But uh, what I was actually planning on, uh, I thought this was a good idea myself, but to have another landing craft, except it's all only for friends. Yeah, that's... People, I think some other YouTubers are talking about it. It would really help the game, but... Because you can already hold all these troops. It would have to... They probably have to nerf all the troops down a little bit to actually make that work. Oh, yeah, well... Good point there. Yeah, I think for me, I think that they should add either a new troop for lower level players. There it goes. Uh, Terror Stage 4 just went down uh, on my on my side. Alright. Or they should add some type of maybe like I mean, I like the events, but you know how they have a, right now they're using a 6 day schedule instead of a 7 day? They are? It says uh, 3 out of 7 right here. I'm on, I'm on stage 3 out of 7. No, no, no. They have a 7 day schedule for what... Uh, oh, for what goes on. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So maybe they get, I, I think they're trying to, they're going to have something in it. Uh, because they're missing out some days here? No, because we're missing one day. And yeah, yeah, which. They could, oh, they could always add that, and they can always get, they can always have one uh, volcano tear and one reg, uh, regular tear a week. They need to have something for, um, okay, what is, what is it called? Uh, I, I don't forgot, I'm sorry. Uh, I, it'll come to me soon. Alright, so I'm looking at. Terry Stage 5, he's basically on the beach. Um, All of it? Yeah, everything's on the beach. So can you flank behind it? I mean, not, not really, because there's so many cannons and stuff back there. So I may have to just try this. I don't think it's going to work out. But for the sake of the video, I think it'll be fun to try. So. Okay. 14,000 health on a, a shock launcher level 1. So how's the statue? What, what does the statue look like exactly? Right. 110% building health, Ooh. and 52% uh, building damage. Mm. So, guys, go ahead and check out this video. This video is going to be pretty good um, on this side, because I gotta, I'm got i going to go ahead and try this. I don't think I'll be able to beat it. Especially with the headquarters having 294,000 health. Oh my gosh. That sounds bad already. Alright, so I'm looking. What can I take... Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and test this and see if I can take out this shock launcher right away. Right. I think that's going to be the only way I can do this. And uh, for you guys that are still watching my video, um, I'm just going to show you guys replays of people attacking my base and also some resource bases defense. Because I already told you guys that my troops are still rearming. Yeah, dude, I, I barely made it um, with that last... Um... Wait, I'm not even know if I'm going to be able to drop my tanks now. Really? <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna have to try this out. Um, I don't think it's gonna work. I'm just gonna do it um, for the sake of the video. I don't really care if I lose the gold, but I guess we gotta try this out. So I'm gonna go ahead and take out this um, cannon right on the beach, and then throw an artillery hit the, with the double hit to take it out. Okay, and now I'm gonna see what's gonna hurt me the most. So I'm going to go ahead and drop a flare right here. It's just going to keep my troops um, to this right side. I'm going to go ahead and start having to use some sh uh, shocks in a minute. Um, hopefully they don't all die already. Um, right here, I'm basically losing all my troops. It's crazy um, how bad this is going to be. This is such a fail. Um, I'm going to go ahead here and try to, try to save my troops a little bit. Um, they're in a good spot. 
They're going to get hit by the shock launcher and all the rockets. So that's going to really hurt them. Um, let me see if I can take out one of the rockets. See. Nope, I wasn't able to. Um, my guys are about to die. I think I'm just going to go after retreat this one. Um, I'm going to go th throw a smoke just to s hopefully save a couple of them. And I think I lost most of them, but that was not going to be able to go down. I think I hit maybe a quarter, not even a quarter of the health on the HQ went down. Ah. I'm so going to have to leave in defeat. I guess I didn't come with a plan like I was supposed to. <laughs> come with a plan or leave in defeat. Plan or leave in defeat. Right. Yeah. Uh, this commercial's getting on my nerves, though. Have you saw any of the Boom Beach commercials? Yeah, I, I think I've watched almost every single one of them. Uh, my favorite's probably, uh, I know it's a short one, but it, it goes, Johnson, attack that boom cannon. Yeah. And he rushes straight towards him and just dies. Uh, limited edition uh, Boom Beach, uh, boom beach uh, t-shirts? Um, no, I have not, actually. Oh, alright, so, um, have you ever checked, uh, I'm just gonna get, um, actually, gonna, right now I'm just gonna give you, um, uh, Bull Cable a shout out. He's actually doing a giveaway on limited edition um, t uh, Boom Beach t-shirts. So go, make sure to go check him out. He's um, he's actually having a giveaway for the for 300, uh, 300, uh, 3,000 subscribers. Hmm, that's right. That's pretty good. Yeah, so uh, make sure you guys all check him out. Um, just look on my channel and go into my featured channels and you can see um, Bull Cable. Go ahead and check him out. He's a really good, he makes really good content, and he's a really nice guy. All right, then. Well, are, are you still attacking the base here? No, I, I'm basically, it's over for me, so um, I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Um, well, actually, one more thing, though. Hit that like button if you like this video. Um, go ahead, a comment if you guys want to see more of this or what you want to see the challenge for next time. If you guys want to try to do, um, maybe we do a, a, Noah, a Noah's Ark raid. If you um, if you guys want to do that, there's a lot of um, ideas that I have that we can do. So I'm just gonna wait for you guys to comment what you guys want to see. I want what you guys want to see of us, and I'll be I'll be working on more content for you guys. Um, make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't already. And Clash, more on in this. Uh yeah. Um, I have one more thing to say here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say once again about the task force here. Uh, we still need people to join here, and uh, the entry requirement is now to zero medals. So, yeah, I that. so I want you guys to join fast as you can. Um, the uh, task force tag will be in the description down below. All right. So um, currently we're doing pretty good in here. Uh, as you guys saw the operation earlier, uh, it looks like it was a complete success here, and we're going to start one uh, in about seven more hours. So I'm really looking forward to that, guys. So, uh, Matt, you got anything else to say? Um, I think I'm just going to go ahead and sign out. All right, guys. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I already said this, but um, and I'll see you all later. Matt, out. All right, guys. Uh, you heard it from Matt there. Um, this is Clash. I'm also going to go ahead and go. Uh, Thank you guys for watching this video. If you did enjoy, make sure to slap that like button in the face for me. It's at the bottom of your screen. It only takes a couple seconds out of your time. Uh, comment if you want to say anything and subscribe for more. And I will see you guys in my next video. Stay cool.